relatively start production on that in the beginning of next year. While the world remains fixated on lithium, something far bigger has just crashed into the EV battlefield. And no, it's not coming from China. It's coming from Elon Musk. Tesla's 2026 aluminum ion battery is no longer a theory. It's here. It's tested. And it's about to flip the entire battery industry on its head. Elon confirmed, we'll start production early next year. The tested version has proven everything we hoped for. This isn't just a battery upgrade. It's the end of China's battery monopoly, and barely anyone is talking about it. So watch closely, because this changes everything. What China didn't want the world to know is now exposed. Tesla's aluminum ion breakthrough just triggered the most aggressive industrial espionage campaign in recent memory. In just 90 days, over 47,000 cyber attacks were launched against Tesla's Gigafactory in Nevada. Intelligence reports point directly to state-backed Chinese hackers. Their mission? Steal the tech. Because they know what this means, the total collapse of China's $340 billion lithium battery empire. What makes this battery so terrifying to China's dominance is one hidden weapon, quantum tunnel architecture. It allows aluminum ions to travel 23 times faster through the battery structure than lithium ions. In practical terms, the battery can discharge its full capacity in just 47 seconds if needed. That makes Chinese fast charging tech look like a joke. But the real shocker is in the design. Inside each aluminum ion cell are nano-engineered graphene channels that self-repair. While lithium batteries degrade with every cycle, Tesla's version actually becomes more efficient over time. After 100,000 charge cycles, they perform 13% better than when they were new. That's not just innovation. That's a death sentence for companies whose business model relies on battery replacements. Now let's talk about the supply chain. While China built its empire on rare materials and lithium scarcity, Tesla chose abundance. Aluminum is everywhere, and North America already produces over 1.1 million tons annually. Through a strategic partnership with Alcoa Corporation, Tesla sidestepped the multi-year mining timeline for lithium and activated existing infrastructure in Texas, Kentucky, and Tennessee. China didn't see this coming. They bet everything on bottlenecks and scarcity. But Musk simply changed the rules. And it gets worse for China. Tesla's aluminum ion battery isn't just better. It's cheaper. Chinese firms like CATL and BYD produce lithium cells at $87 per kilowatt hour using mass subsidies and cheap labor. Tesla's aluminum ion battery? $61 per kilowatt hour. That's a 30% drop in cost. Why? Because aluminum extraction needs 65% less energy than lithium. The refining process is simpler, the materials are abundant, and the industrial base is already in place. Tesla isn't building new supply chains. It's hijacking and upgrading old ones. Tesla's Nevada Gigafactory can retrofit its existing lines in just eight months, versus the three-year timeline it takes China to build a new lithium facility. By Q3 of 2026, Tesla aims to produce 2.1 terawatt hours annually. Enough to power over 6.2 million vehicles per year, all made in the US. This breaks China's pricing stranglehold. In 2024, battery exports made China $43 billion. But what happens when Tesla sells a product that's cheaper and better? Chinese firms face a nightmare scenario slash prices and lose all profit, or keep prices high and lose the market. Either way, 
It's a blow that could collapse entire sectors. Tesla's raw material advantage is locked in through exclusive long-term contracts. Alcoa, Norsk Hydro, and Century Aluminum have already committed to fixed-price supply agreements through 2032. That means stable costs and no risk from volatile markets or geopolitics, unlike China's entire battery economy. And then comes the cold. China's lithium batteries fail in winter. Below minus 10 degrees Celsius, they lose up to 40% of their capacity. EVs become useless. Chinese manufacturers have dumped billions into thermal management systems with minimal results. Tesla didn't try to manage the problem. It eliminated it. Aluminum ion chemistry retains 96% of its capacity at minus 30 degrees Celsius. In tests at Tesla's Minnesota facility, batteries showed less than 2% degradation after 72 hours at minus 40 degrees Celsius. Chinese lithium batteries under the same conditions? Unusable. A Tesla Model 2 with aluminum ion batteries gets 387 miles at minus 20 degrees Celsius. Compare that to Chinese EVs, which struggle to hit 180 miles in those same conditions. In Norway's Arctic trials, Tesla owners reported 94% satisfaction with aluminum ion batteries. Chinese alternatives scored 31%. Even charging time in cold weather? Unaffected. Aluminum ion batteries charge at full speed, even at minus 35 degrees Celsius. No preheating. No long waits. This isn't just an upgrade, it makes EVs viable in nearly half the global market that lithium left behind. Still not convinced? The real-world testing results will silence any doubt. Tesla ran the most brutal testing program ever, 2,847 pre-production EVs across 47 states racking up 18.3 million miles. The results were independently verified and published in the peer-reviewed Journal of Power Sources. The verdict? After 500,000 miles, aluminum ion batteries retained 94.7% of their original capacity. China's best lithium batteries? 73.2%. That's a 15-year battery lifespan for Tesla. Chinese batteries barely make it 8. Then there's safety. Lithium ion fires have made headlines, and for good reason. But aluminum ion chemistry doesn't suffer from thermal runaway. In 10,000 destructive tests, punctures, overcharges, extreme heat, not one single aluminum ion cell caught fire. Not one. Insurance companies have noticed. Some are already offering 23% lower premiums for aluminum ion EVs. And if you're wondering who else trusts it, the U.S. Department of Defense. Tesla's battery tech has been selected for the next-gen combat vehicle platform. Because when reliability is life or death, even the Pentagon chooses aluminum ion. But this isn't just about batteries. It's about the future of EV design. Aluminum ion cells operate without liquid cooling. Air cooling is now possible, eliminating 47 pounds of thermal hardware. It's cheaper, simpler, and reduces production costs by $1,200 per vehicle. Tesla's batteries also integrate seamlessly with ultracapacitors, perfect for regenerative braking and acceleration bursts. The result? 0 to 60 in 2.8 seconds, and over 400 miles of range. And for the first time ever, rooftop solar becomes practical. Tesla's flexible solar panels connect directly to the battery without conversion tech, providing up to 45 miles of daily range from sunlight alone. For city drivers, that means complete grid independence. 
And yes, battery swapping is finally real. Each module weighs just 18 pounds and can be replaced in under 6 minutes. Tesla is partnering with battery-as-a-service providers to offer subscription models that eliminate ownership, maintenance, and range anxiety. The revolution isn't coming. It's already here. Tesla's 2026 aluminum-ion battery doesn't just compete, it crushes. It breaks China's hold on the energy future. It puts America back in the driver's seat. And it may be the most important industrial shift since the invention of the electric motor. If you believe this is the breakthrough we've been waiting for, type finally here in the comments right now. And don't forget, subscribe to West, hit the bell, and share this video with someone still clinging to lithium dreams. Because history just changed, and it's made of aluminum.